I have no idea who these women are. I have no idea. I have no idea. And I think you all know I have no idea because you understand me for a lot of years. When you looked at that horrible woman last night, you said, I don't think so. I don't know. Whoever she is, wherever she comes from, the stories are total fiction. They're 100% made up. They never happened. They never would happen. I don't think they happened with very many people, but they certainly aren't going to happen with me. Well, you know, my people always say, oh, don't talk about it. Talk about jobs. Talk, Talk about, about the economy. economy. Don't, Don't worry, your jobs are going to be full. They, they are going to be coming back to North, North Carolina, Carolina like you've never seen. Yeah. But, but I feel I have, I have to, to talk, talk about it. Because you have to dispute it when somebody, somebody says something. something. And Unfortunately, Unfortunately, we have the microphone. We're able to dispute Some people can't. These are lies being pushed by, by the media and the Clinton, Clinton campaign to try and keep their grip on our country. They are all false. They're totally invented. Fiction. All 100% totally and completely fabricated. Never, never met this person, person, these people. I don't know who they are. I don't know who they are. Think of what's happening to our country. Think of what's happening. I don't know who these people are. I look on television. I think it's a disgusting thing. And it's being pushed. They have no witnesses. There's nobody around. They, they just, just come out, out, some are doing, doing it for probably a little fame. fame. Yeah. They, they get, get some free fame. fame. It's, it's a total setup. Now, now suddenly, after, after many, many, many years, phony accusers come out less than a month, month before one of the most important elections in the history of our country. country. Yeah. It also it comes at a time as WikiLeaks unveils horrible, horrible things about Hillary Clinton. Clinton. But they'd rather talk, talk about, about this. this. Somebody, Somebody that you've never seen, seen this at all. In 1992, he went, went like this. this. <laughs> <laughs> One, One came, came out recently where I was sitting, sitting alone in some club. club. I, I, I really, really don't, don't sit alone that much. Honestly, I don't think I sit alone. alone. I, I go into a group of people. I was sitting alone by myself. Like this. <laughs> and then I went, wow. <laughs> I just heard this one. It's, it's like, it's, it's like unbelievable. <laughs> Even a simple investigation would have shown these allegations against me. In just about all cases, it's nonsense. It's false. And eyewitnesses has already debunked the People Magazine story. Here's my question about the dishonest writer from People Magazine. Why didn't she write what she said happened before, before she wrote, wrote the story. <laughs> Why did she put it in the story? The story would have been one of the big stories. I was the big star of The Apprentice. Why did she do it 12 years ago? 12 years ago. She's writing the story. Now think of this. Think of this. She's a liar. She's a liar. She's writing the story. Check out her Facebook page. You'll understand.